I'm gonna give you three ways to learn how to trust yourself again with alcohol. Because the saddest part of alcohol use disorder is feeling like you're at war with yourself. My name is Colleen and I help professional women reduce their drinking so they can stop worrying about overdoing it. Number one, stop trying to make decisions about how much your future self will or won't drink. There is no right amount or perfect amount of alcohol. Alcohol affects you differently every single time based on how much sleep and how much stress you've had, what you've had to eat, who you're around, your hormones. You can't think and know how much alcohol you need. You have to do and feel and then adjust accordingly. Number two, the change you need to make is not how much alcohol you drank last night. It's how you treat yourself today. Beating yourself up about yesterday creates a shame cycle that makes it more likely you're gonna drink today. Instead, ask yourself, what did I do right? How have I improved? Give yourself full credit for partial wins. Number three, learn from your mistakes. When you overdrink, it's because you're on autopilot. You're just running on habit mode. Sometimes it's really simple. You were just busy and engaged and not paying attention. You forgot to count. But sometimes it's because you're trying to avoid or change a feeling. And so stopping and asking yourself, what was that feeling? And how could I have processed that feeling in a way that served me better is a really important question. Change is a process. You don't flip a switch and become somebody different. So constantly looking about how you can improve one degree at a time is how you move forward. Follow me for more tips and strategies and find my podcast, It's Not About the Alcohol. That's what it's called. It's not about the alcohol.